Hello, this is Dr. Dabajan, Critical Care Fellow here at the University of Florida Shands. We'll be talking very briefly about pulmonary edema on patients, and as we discussed previously, those types of patients typically have a B profile. You basically want to start off with the cardiac probe, although you can use also the abdominal probe, and start off on the anterior part of the chest on either side. Typically, um, you can go uh, midclavicular until you actually see the profile that you want. And, um, again, you're going to be looking for the bat sign or two ribs, rib shadows uh, that flank lung tissue. You're going to identify the pleura itself with a hyperechoic line, and then typically with pulmonary congestion, um, ARDS, any kind of process that's going to fill uh, or flood the alveoli, you're going to see B lines. And B lines typically extend from the top of the screen all the way to the bottom. And in pulmonary edema, you typically want to see two B lines, two or more B lines uh, on your view uh, on each side uh, to kind of classify a B profile. You can also look for pulmonary edema in other parts of the chest. Typically this is done by kind of going more lateral to your initial uh, placement over the anterior chest. So as you down and looking at other segments of the chest, after you're done with one side, you move on to the next side. 